powered by Vyanet. Make the right connection. Namaste everyone, this is Ural from Gazette Byte and our smartphone has unveiled 5 new products here in Nepal. So let's have a quick look at these phones. The phone I am carrying right now is Arc S A5 SD. It is the company's flagship phone and it features a 5 inch IPS LCD screen with high definition resolution, boosts a quad core CPU with 1 GB of RAM, and there is 8 GB of internal storage which can be further expanded by micro SD card. And it boosts a 13 megapixel primary camera with LED flash and a 3 megapixel front facing camera. So let's have a look at the primary camera. Let's have a click, and you can see the photos don't come out very natural despite being a 13 megapixel so you have to look at the sensor as well and as far as the specs are concerned it is pretty standard uh, there is nothing spectacular about this phone although it is priced at only 14,490 mm, the phone has got mediocre build quality and the back is actually removable and uh, the battery is accessible and you have a 2000 milliamp hour battery and for connectivity you get like two dual sim like any other phones and there is Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and GPS so I guess Arc is a 5 SD is a very good reasonable phone but nothing spectacular about it uh, I would rather recommend you to buy Xiaomi Redmi 1S which is my best budget phone by the way or you can also look at the Huawei Honor Holly one of the good phones to buy at a uh, of 15,000 price margin. So other phones of Arc Mobiles include Arc Icon R45 which is priced at Rs 11,490. Similarly we also have Arc Icon R40 Plus which is priced at Rs 9,690 and there are two other phones in the name of Arc Storm K40 which is priced at Rs 8,190 and finally we have Arc Storm K35 Plus which is priced at Rs 6,090. So that's all for the early hands on of the Arc smartphone. See you on my next video and if you haven't subscribed us do click the subscribe button below and have a nice day. Get the fastest speeds on 100% fiber. Vyanet, the best thing that happened to internet in Nepal.